this lesson we're going to take a look at how you can find the mean, the median, and the mode. So what vocabulary am I going to need to know? Well the mean, the mean is the average. You find that by adding all the numbers up in the um, data set and you divide them by the number of numbers you have there. The median is the middle number. And in order to find the middle number, you need to put the numbers in order from least to greatest. The mode. The mode is the number that occurs the most in the data set. And the range is the difference between the highest number and the lowest number in the data set. Alright, so I need to find the mean, the median, the mode, and the range of these shoe sizes. Each X is represented by one pair of shoes. So it means that I've got six, or I've got three size six shoes. I've got two size seven shoes, one size eight shoe, and two size nine shoes. And because I have a total of eight shoes, I'm going to divide by eight. So I'm going to take, and I'll add up all these numbers, and I'm going to get a total of 58 then all over 8. So I'm going to take, and on my calculator, I'm going to divide 58 divided by 8, and I'm going to get a shoe size of an average of 7.25. Alright, so let's find the median. Well, if you remember before when I defined what median was, median is the middle number. And to find the middle number, you need to put the numbers in order from least to greatest. So I've got 6, 6, 6, 7, 7, 8, 9, and 9. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to calculate from each end. I'm just going to find the middle number. Well, in this case, I've got two size 7s in the middle. So, size, so 7 is going to be, my, average, or is going to be my, my median. If it happened to be that I had two different numbers there, I would take the two numbers and I would average them together by adding them together and dividing by 2. So my median here that I have is equal to 7. Alright, and the mode. Well, the mode we remember is by finding the most, the, uh, the data that occurs the most. And if you can see up top here, the size 6 shoe is the one that occurs the most. So my mode is um, 6. My range, well it's the difference between my highest number and my, my lowest number. And so my highest number in my data set is 9, and my lowest number in my data set is 6. So I'm going to find the difference by subtracting them. 9 minus 6 is equal to 3. So my range of shoe sizes is 3 sizes. Alright, so we're going to take a look at the stem and leaf plot and find the mean, the median, mode, and range. Before we start, let's just take a look at review what a stem and leaf plot is. I have all the numbers to the left of the line are going to represent the tens place, and all the numbers to the right of the line are going to represent the ones, and I can tell that because this key shows that the number 8, the line, and then 5 represents 85. So remember to find the mean, we're going to add up all the numbers. And so this number here doesn't represent 2 or it doesn't represent 7, it represents 72. So I'm going to take and I'm going to add up all these numbers. And then I'm going to divide by the number of numbers that I just added up. And because I just added up, I'm going to add up eight numbers, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I've got eight numbers. So now when I go and I add up all these numbers, I'm going to have 663, and I'm going to divide that by eight to get my mean. So I'll go on my calculator and take 663 divided by eight, and I'm going to get a mean of 82.875. And I'll just round it from um, 82.9, I'll just round it to, there we go. All right, so let's go ahead and we're going to find the median. Well, the median, remember, you need to put all the numbers from least to greatest. So I'm going to list all the numbers. All 
All right, so now that I've got them all listed, I'm going to find the median or the middle number. So I'm going to cross off from the bottom and I'll cross off the next number and the next one. And here we go again. We've got two numbers that are in the middle, but these two numbers in the middle don't equal the same thing. So I'm going to add the two numbers up and then I'm going to divide by two because I'm finding the average of them. And so my mean, or I'm sorry, my median is going to be 81.5. My mode is a number that occurs the most. Well, the number that occurs the most is 80, so I've got that. And now my range. I need to take my top number, which is 95, and my bottom number, which is 72, and I need to find the difference between them. So I'll do it on my calculator, 95 minus 72, and I've got 23. So my range is 23. So in this lesson, you learned how to find the mean, the median, the mode, and the range.